What are the signs or when should you take your pet snake to the veterinarian? Well, number one, initially when you get your pet snake, it's not a bad idea to take them to the vet so they can get a good look to make sure that they don't have any parasites. Ectoparasites, which are mites and ticks and things that are on the outside that can cause illness, and endoparasites, worms and things of that nature, that your veterinarian can help you with. Other than that, it's very important to watch your snake. It should be nice and lively like this boa constrictor, should be alert, should be moving, the tongue should be moving, eyes clear, mouth clear, breathing normally, there's no straining. He should not be maneuvering around the uh, terrarium with an open mouth. That many times will mean that he's having a hard time breathing. It also sometimes, if he's frantically moving around his terrarium with an open mouth, can mean that the terrarium is too hot. So also check the temperature. If he's having a hard time shedding, snakes will normally shed all of their skin all at one time. If he does not, if it comes in pieces, many times it means that we've got a problem that you need to take a look at. They should be nice and round. They shouldn't be tucked in along their spine. They should be nice and shiny like this guy is. There shouldn't be any bruises or changes in colors along the belly. Should be going to the bathroom regularly and eating well. If you're not getting any of these things, if you start to hear a hissing or a gurgling when they're eating, if there's a foul odor coming from their mouth, these are all indications that you need to get to your veterinarian to have him take a look. Music